my father was a Hebrew teacher and tried to teach me Hebrew, and I resisted foolishly. So he hired a friend to teach me Hebrew, and the friend liked mathematical puzzles. So half of every lesson consisted of mathematical puzzles. So that started, generated my interest in mathematics. I think inequalities are at the heart of work in partial differential equations. Yes. And I sometimes say inequalities make the world go round. I worked on some interpolation inequalities, mm -hmm. which I discovered had been done independently by Gagliardo, an right. Italian mathematician. Right. And they're often referred to as Gagliardo Nuremberg right. inequalities. Yes. And again, they turn out to be very useful. Like most of math mathematicians in elliptic PD of the maximum principle where you worked, a lot with the moving plane method. Yeah, the maximum principle, which says that the maximum of a solution of a particular class of equations occurs on the boundary. That's just a fantastic tool. Didas and Dee and I used it to prove some symmetry of solutions for certain nonlinear elliptic equations. We used a method introduced by mm -hmm. A.D. Alexandrov, a Russian geometer. And since then, people continue to use what we call the moving plane method to solve problems that I find unlikely to be solved using that method, but people keep coming up with new applications. Some thoughts about your career being all at the Courant Institute. I think I've had a very lucky life on the whole, getting the way I got there and, and having wonderful colleagues, wonderful students, mm -hmm. wonderful friends in the world. It's a mathematics family is is not a very big, but a very nice, warm family. Something really, to my mind, something really remarkable. We had visitors from Russia, of course, over the years. At one time, Olenik, a Russian mm -hmm. woman, a mathematician, yes, was visiting, yes. gave a series mm -hmm. of lectures. Yes, yes. And she complained to me after a while that Peter Lacks is sleeping in her lectures, which he often does. So at her next lecture, uh, Peter wrote something on a piece of paper and passed it around. And it said, we the undersigned testify that Peter Lacks has slept through some of our best lectures. <laughs> Everybody signed it and it was given to Elenik at the end of the lecture. I told her she should frame it. <laughs> <laughs>